In the spring of 2019, the Department of the Air Force released the Air Force Science and Technology Strategy. The strategy's guiding vision is an Air Force that dominates time, space, and complexity in future conflict across all operating domains to project power and defend the homeland. Let's take a look at some of the top accomplishments over the last year as we respond to the strategy's call to action. The Air Force announced the first three Vanguard programs, Golden Horde, Navigation Technology Satellite 3, and Skyborg. The Air Force established a Provisional Transformational Capabilities Office to facilitate new transformational S&T business processes, including experimentation and prototyping management of the Vanguards. Air Force Explore is a new approach for technology market calls, increasing access to the business, science, and technology community. The internal AFRL S&T Seedlings for Disruptive Capabilities awards airmen, scientists, and engineers up to $5 million in annual funding to execute high-risk, high-payoff ideas that create new capabilities for the future force. WarTech is a new warfighting technologist process that unites Air Force enterprise priorities and future force requirements. WarTech culminates with a summit and helps ensure warfighters are continually equipped for the best technology. We've highlighted just a few of this past year's successes. There are many more business process improvements behind the scenes and more to come. The Air Force will continually draw on best practices from industry, academia, and other government leaders to secure the nation and ensure the success of our future air and space forces.